what we're going to be doing is doing a smooth flow treatment, which is a combination of the uh, M22 luminous IPL device that we have here to treat a lot of the browns and the blood vessels on the face. And then we're going to follow it with the volyderm, which is the radio frequency of microneedling, to help improve the texture and tone of the skin. So we're putting a little jelly on here, which is a conducting jelly first, to help with the IPL light. So we're going to get started here. You doing good? Doing good. All right. You may feel a little zap here, a little light, but everything will be fine. Tell me if it's too uncomfortable for you. Okay. Mm -hmm. right, you can see it. Ready? Set. Go. Did you feel that? No. How uncomfortable is that? I'm scared of one to ten. One. No, I didn't. I didn't feel that. Doing good. Grateful to Sandra for all of the numbing. The main thing is it helps with texture and tone of the skin, a little tightening, improvement in the pore sizes, and with the IPL, a lot of improvement in the pigmentation of the uh, blood vessel, background blood vessel. So that's the main thing that she's doing. We just finished the IPL, and what we're going to do now is move towards radio frequency microneedling. But the IPL targeted a lot of the pigmentation and the blood vessels in your skin. And when I get to the radio frequency microneedling, that's going to create a little tiny uh, needle penetration through the skin. It's going to deliver a radio frequency energy to help heat up the collagen and tighten. So what we're doing here is delivering radio frequency energy through these tiny little needles that you see here and they go uh, into the skin, they penetrate and then as I press the foot pedal, the foot pedal activates and it creates a radio frequency energy between the pins, heating up the collagen to close to hopefully 40 degrees and that causes contraction and tightening of the collagen in the skin. And um, We'll see some improvement in your skin over the next couple of weeks, couple of days. So right now we're actually on a fairly aggressive level for her, just making sure she gets a really nice treatment after the first time. And um, uh, it's more of a little bit of an advanced treatment to get the best results in, in one treatment. And she'll get a lot of tightening of the collagen, a lot of improvement. And You'll see a significant benefit even after just one treatment. So what you see is you see all the redness and swelling a little bit. That's normal. That's from the heat energy that is being applied to the skin. And you know you should feel a little bit of um, heat as this goes in, and you are feeling that, right? A little bit, yeah. Yeah. No, it's just a, a way of kind of building up on your first treatment and building up and kind of continuing to improve and tighten and retexturize mm -hmm. the skin. Okay, so it doesn't necessarily go away. Mm -hmm. It's just building and building and improving with each and subsequent treatment. Okay, that's the main thing. Okay, with all all these treatments, you're getting the benefit and you're continuing to improve and, and tighten the skin, and that's what we're. Um, that's what our main objective mm -hmm. is, is to tighten the skin. And is that just because your skin is always changing? That's why people do that? Well, changes. we're always aging. Yeah. Okay, so consequently, because we're always aging and we're always out in the sun, we're always causing damage to our skin. So we're 
constantly aging our skin with uh, improper protection to our skin, sun damage, UV damage. And so this is trying to build it as we go along. So this doesn't stop the aging process, it just kind of improves it. Well, with the IPL, sometimes some of these little brown spots might get a little darker and then they'll kind of flake off. Okay, so you might expect some little bit of improvement in these little brown discolorations, but they will get a little darker and they'll start to flake off over the next week. Um, with the IP, with the um, microneedling radio frequency, it's delivering a little bit of heat energy into the skin, and sometimes you might feel a little sandpaper feeling to the skin, and that will get better over over time. Um, you can use makeup. It's not anything that you know is going to harm you if you need to go out somewhere. So you will notice that your skin over the next several weeks will start to look a little bit more fresh, feel better. Uh, but within the first week, you might notice that you know it's kind of scabbing a little bit from the, the brown discoloration that's improving and starting to peel. And with the radio frequency microneedling, you might get a little sandpaper feeling, but not not much uh, more than that. Okay. Okay, so it's been a month now since we did her first treatment and we're doing the, we just started the second treatment here and the second treatment is going to help add to the improvement in texture and tone by doing the radio frequency and microneedling. Not, uh, not feeling any pain or discomfort? No, I'm fine. Okay, here we go. Am I hurting you? No, it's okay. walking into Jupiter Dermatology right now for my third smooth board treatment. So now I am getting numb. Kendra hooked me up again. Kendra, say hi. She's the best because she makes this experience as comfortable as possible by numbing my face so I don't feel the microneedling or the lights. And why do you lose collagen over time? Um, just a natural degradation, uh, sun, you know, sun definitely causes degradation of collagen and elastin, okay, mm -hmm. but, you know, just like anything else, you know, our collagen does degrade over time, slowly, you know, we, we age over time, that's just part of the aging process. So to maintain something like this, do you suggest people come in once a month, or is it different for everybody? There are people that do this every month just because they like it and they're seeing a you know, tremendous amount of results. So uh, everybody's different. You know, we recommend a series of, of three at least to get the ball rolling. And then from there, you can do it quarterly. You can do it, you know, uh, monthly. You can do it you know, every two months. You know, um, all depends on each individual person. We try to customize it. A week after my third appointment at Jupiter Dermatology, I took some after pictures. And I can tell a big difference. 